Y'all remember that easter egg website that launched like two months ago for one of the Black Ops Cold War reveals? Well that ARG finally came to an end and I don't really know what the story bits we learned from it was because it was dragged on forever and I just tuned out of it. But I do know that you can get a bunch of free items for Modern Warfare, Call of Duty Mobile, and Black Ops Cold War when it launches including this sweet Master Adventure blueprint for the AK-47. Which, by the way, I got a 36 and 2 gameplay on Scrapyard, which you will see throughout this video. And anyone with a Call of Duty account can get these items for free. You don't need to do all these steps for the Easter egg ARG or anything like that. I sure as hell didn't. I just logged into the site on the last day. So here's how you can go about doing that. The process is fairly straightforward. You want to go to pawntakepawn.com slash deaddraw. The link to that website will be in the description. And you want to make sure that you have dead draw tagged on at the end because pawntakespawn.com, if you just type that in by itself, it will take you to a different part of this ARG website. If you've logged into the site before, it'll ask you to sign in. If you've never logged in before, you will have to sign up and you can sign up with any email or password for this website. It doesn't need to be linked to your Call of Duty account or anything like that. You can go make a burner email and sign up with it just to get your codes. This is an official Activision website. You can see their terms of service and links and all that stuff. And it's all official marketing material. So once you sign up, you can verify your email and then you will sign into the website. Make sure you are on pawntakepawn.com slash deaddraw and you will see an area where you can enter in a code and the code you have to enter in is one pieces nine in eight play one that will be on the screen right now and also be in the description and once you do enter this code it will take you to the final page of the ARG with a video that wraps the whole thing up and you'll notice in the top right corner of this screen it will show you the dead draw achievement has been unlocked with a little notification if you didn't see that, you can go and verify that dead draw was unlocked in the actual achievements page itself. And if it happens to not be there, just try going back to uh, pawntakepawn.com slash dead draw and entering the code again when you're logged in. But you'll notice in the top right hand corner of that notification or when you're on the achievements page there will be a little white link that says click here to claim your rewards. You click that and you'll be brought to a screen that shows you three unique codes for you to redeem on all the official Activision websites. The Warzone and Black Ops Cold War are done on the Call of Duty website itself when you're logged on to your Call of Duty account. You enter that code, you redeem it and that stuff will instantly be applied to your account. And for COD mobile you will have to log into the actual mobile game itself and get your uid number and you'll have to enter that into the redeem page of that website so it'll be applied to your account so again you sign up go to the website enter the code redeem your rewards and then put those codes in on the various websites pretty straightforward the call of duty mobile rewards are pretty cool you get a actual weapon for the game which looks like to be a remington shotgun I hope I haven't played Call of Duty Mobile too much, so I'm not too familiar with the game. But you also get a calling card, an avatar, a spray, and a frame for the game. And all these rewards are tied into this ARG. I know in one point you had to play like these old school Activision games to find out certain information so you can get to the next step. So it's reminiscent of that, which is pretty nice. For uh, Black Ops Cold War, you will be getting a chess piece weapon charm to use in Black Ops Cold War, as well as the family portrait calling card, which is pretty funny. It's, you know, a, a family portrait of zombies with a uh, new going off behind them in the middle of the field, which also appears to be on fire. Pretty neat stuff. And then lastly, Modern Warfare gets the most rewards. You get a weapon blueprint for the AK-47, which we'll go over in just a second. You also get the Air Raid helicopter skin, which is a pretty neat looking skin itself. And then you get five calling cards, five emblems, and five sprays, which are themed after the Pawn Take Pawn event itself, as well as some of those games you played in the ARG, like Chopper Command, etc., etc. So you get a lot of stuff just for entering a code on the screen. I'm not sure exactly how long this will be active for, so I would recommend redeeming this stuff sooner rather than later.
Now, as for the ARG itself and what we've learned from it, I actually have like no clue what's going on. Uh, and if you if you do happen to know, please feel free to share it down below in the comments. Let us all know. Your comment may even get pinned because I would really like to know what is going on with this. I know a little bit, uh, but I just tune out because again, there was it seemed like drawn out just little lore tidbits that I don't feel like aren't going to be too important for the game, but they may tie in in some way in the Cold War campaign. Who knows? But uh, from what my understanding understanding was there was this mystery guy who was contacting us and we kind of worked to figure out clues and then in the end we found out uh in this reveal that was this week that this guy is bowman from black ops one that uh it's, it's his son from that game i'm not sure if that will play a major role in the campaign or not again we'll have to wait and see uh you know some people are into args i just didn't really care much for this one. This is, again, this went way back to two months ago when all the creators got some care packages with projectors and slides that led us to a certain area in Summit in Black Ops 4, again, months ago. And then we we're looking for codes in Verdansk and doing all these other puzzles in Black Ops Cold War, uh, Black Ops 4, Warzone, Modern Warfare, Call of Duty Mobile. It just didn't seem like it was leading that much, so I just didn't really care. But it led to these rewards that you can redeem for free. But again, if you know like, what the whole story was for this, please share it down down below in the comments. Uh, last thing here, I want to show you this blueprint in depth. It's Selfie Master Adventure, which is a pretty neat looking uh, skin, if I'd say so myself. It's kind of like a cartoony brown and cartoony gold skin with this weird wallpaper it looks like on it, but then the barrel of the gun actually looks pretty freaking sexy. It's a nice Romanian barrel that you can use for Gunsmith Customs on other AK loadouts. It's nicely black with gold detailing on it. It's a pretty nice looking uh, blueprint. Uh, the attachments I just mentioned, you get the Romanian barrel for this, you get the flash guard, the 40 round mags, the stipple grip tape, and fully loaded. Pretty decent setup by itself. But again, if you guys plan on playing Call of Duty for the next year, whether that be Modern Warfare or Black Ops Cold War, they've said Black Ops Cold War is going to be integrated into Warzone. You should be able to use cosmetics from Modern Warfare in the cross integration thing. Uh, we're not exactly sure how that's all going to be working out. But I would highly recommend redeeming this stuff so you could potentially use it in the future. They did reveal today, uh, I guess I might as well mention this in this video, that they're going to handle Warzone similar to what they did with Modern Warfare in Black Ops Cold War. And that it's not going to be available right at launch. But I think around like December 19th or somewhere around there is when Black Ops Cold War will be fully integrated into Warzone. That's supposed to line up with the Season 1 launch of Black Ops Cold War. So again, we're getting like the Season 0 starting season for the first few weeks of Cold War and then we'll be diving in season one and getting our hands into Warzone. So if you guys have any questions for any part of this ARG or how to redeem your free stuff, leave a comment down below. I will surely get back to you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button and consider subscribing and turning on that bell notification. If you'd like to help support my channel, check the links down below in the description. There's a bunch of different ways you can do that. As always, guys, thanks for watching. My name is Sinister Skater. I'll catch y'all on the next video. Peace out.